like winter and I mean it is not even four o'clock and it is 41 degrees outside Madeline is yeah, walking like in the door it doesn't it feels colder no hotter does it really yes huh what did you come walking in with it's mac and cheese oh our neighbor miss um Heather made vegan mac and cheese I'm so excited I cannot wait to try it I actually have the real deal mac and cheese in the oven for tonight. Um, and I've got some barbecue chicken, so not vegan meal over here. Um, but we're going to Bath and Body Works. Yes, Emily is dying to go to Bath and Body Works. I'm going to go for one, two, five days now. And what is it that you're looking for there? Well, there's this little Christmas thing, like it was at a Christmas hand sanitizers, Christmas ah. diffuser thing, and but... So Christmas what? scents is what you're in the mood for, right? Yeah. But and she's getting a little cute snack things. of soup. Huh? Out now. Yes, I'm sure they are. What are you it eating? Said, a it said, oh. Mom, it said... Only on Saturday. Oh, well, maybe they have other deals. They always run deals, so maybe we can find another deal. Maybe the deal of the day is like, I love it when they have their candles for um, the three wick candles for like. But she won't let me get a or candle. Or something, is it? Yeah, I don't let you have a candle in your room. You're right. Um, I get candles in my room now. Well, that only got started when last year. What else? But there was something else I was going to tell you. Um, hey. Oh, to... that's what it is. Look at this purple jacket I found for Emily at Costco, y'all. $9.99. $9.99. Seriously. Like, and it is so cozy. And I love the color. It's called... I hot today. I think it's called purple wood or plum wood, wine wood or something like that. I don't remember. I don't remember. But anyway... We are going to, do you want to go to Bath and Body Works? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah, oh my God. Um, oh gosh, look, I just got my nails done last week and it already chipped right there. And it is getting hung on everything. Like everything I touch, it's pulling and it's driving me crazy. But I'm just too cheap to go have it fixed. And it's not that close by, so I have to make a special trip all the way over there and I just don't want to do it. Well, let's go finish your snack. No, 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 Finish your snack. And then I've got to, I can't leave for another 20 minutes because I got to get my macaroni and cheese out. And then we'll go really quick before we get stuck in traffic. Not quick. Come back and then we'll eat dinner. Deal? No, we're not staying there for hours. And we're only going to Bath and Body Works. No, 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 no. We might have to go to just this. No, this is not a trip for justice. Or it is Michael's only, I don't even have enough lights on in here. Mine. Only Bath and Body Works. Ah. There. I keep on getting stuck There's the light. Everything. Oh, yes. That is the prettiest sweater. I got then. stuck on somebody's binder. <gasps> oh my gosh. And then somebody kept on walking when I got st stuck on them, so I had a string hanging down the ground and I had to cut it. Ooh, I hope when you cut it, it's not gonna start unraveling your sweater. Didn't think about that, did you? Girl, Lord have mercy. Just like she almost tried to dry that sweater, but thankfully it no, didn't. No, it was it a didn't. different sweater that I washed and dried. Yeah, it didn't make it to the um, laundry basket, but that cannot get dried and it has to get washed by itself on delicate, I think. I have to even oh double check if it can even get washed. All right, so we made it here. Look how pretty Von Mar looks. Can you tell? Oh, it's so pretty. Look how pretty. And they finally put out the Christmas. They did. And I was just thinking on the way here, 
if you're counting, it is one week and one day till, cue the music. Lights go up in the car. Who's excited? I cannot Me. wait. Who likes the lights? Me. Me too. One week and one day, friends. And then, yep, it's Christmas. It is Christmas season. Yep. All right, let's go find some Christmas stuff. Ready, girls? Yep. Gingerbread squirrel. Squirrel. Have you smelled them? Do you like the way they smell? Uh -huh. That one has this one. It's bouncing all over the store like crazy woman. Look, this is their new fragrance one and it smells so good. And the stars. And it comes in a little um, roll on perfume. Very cool. Ooh, it's sparkling though. I like it. That smells good. What's it called? Um, Winterberry Wonderland. Daddy needs so he can sleep good at night. So he can sleep good at night. That's right. He has a hard time sleeping, staying asleep. Who else has that problem? too much. I mean, really? These girls, really? We were coming in just to get like a couple things. Not over a hundred dollars worth of stuff. But they're worth it. Look at that. I thought that would be fun just to have one big old carrot mm -hmm. to eat with your dinner. Is it yummy? Mm -hmm. Bennett, yummy? Mm -hmm. Comment down below if you like balsamic vinegar on your carrots. Ooh, that sounds yummy. Comment down below it if you like ranch on your carrots. Just don't spill any on my tablecloth. I'm the only one you have to be worried about because mine's more liquidy than I know. Daddy's having to work late to cover for that um, amount of money we spent at Bath and Body Works. Um, so we're going to start dinner without him and he will eat dinner um, when he gets home. So. Bennett, will you be the man and will you say the blessing for us? God is good, God is great, let us know for our food, by his hands, we are fed. Thank you for our day of birth. Amen. Amen. For some reason this year, I don't know why, but I'm ready to put Christmas decorations up. Am I the only one that feels like this? Like, I never get in the mood to put Christmas stuff up until like the weekend of Thanksgiving. Like Thanksgiving's on Thursday, and then I'm usually ready that Saturday, Sunday, to, hey buddy, your mama starts talking and you start talking too, don't you? Oh, sweet boy. But I don't know, like we, that's usually when we start doing, I start adding a few things, and cause it's usually the Alabama Auburn game, and Jay and Bennett usually go and the girls and I stay here and start putting a few Christmas things out. I don't know, like I'm ready to just decorate. And I don't know if it's because I told myself this year, 
I'm doing something totally different. I'm gonna not use my same decorations that I normally do. Um, I've bought some new decorations. Maybe that has something to do with it. Um, maybe, I don't know. Um, I know this holiday season is gonna be very hard for our family, um, so you would think I would not want to even approach it, but for some reason I'm approaching it with this very positive attitude and I'm ready to get it going. Like I've been listening to Christmas music. It's made me really happy. It's, I, I don't know. It's just been a very odd start to my holiday season. Um, but do you decorate before Thanksgiving? Do you decorate after Thanksgiving? Like, are you a last minute decorator? When do you decorate? Um, and do you have the itch this year to like go ahead and get it up? I mean, it's really weird. Like I never ever feel like this, but I do this year. Anyway, Jay made it home from work. He's had dinner. Emily is asleep. She went to sleep at like 7.15. Um, I tell you, the mornings, I don't know if you saw my tweet this morning, but I was just like, really? Like it's a fight every day with my kids to wake up. The bus comes at 6.50. We have not, they have not ridden the bus in over a week because they just cannot get up. And they go to bed at 8.30. Um, Malin's in bed by nine and Emily sometimes is even in bed, usually 7.45. So she was out tonight. I put her to bed about 7.15. I told Bennett, like you have till eight. And then I told Malin, 8.30. And we're gonna see how tomorrow goes and it's just a fight and I'm, it just starts the day off wrong you know like that's just not fun it's not fun when everybody's fussing and everybody's in a bad mood and grumpy and you start waking them up at six o'clock and nobody rolls out of bed till 6 40 and you're like well you've missed the bus now because the bus comes in 10 minutes and Bennett hasn't had a shower nobody's had breakfast nobody has clothes on Nobody's finished making lunches. I mean, I just don't like to start my day off like that. So I was really frustrated this morning. Um, but anyway, we're over the hump of the week and now we're smooth sailing into the weekend, hopefully. We had so much fun at Bed Bath, I was gonna say it again, Bed Bath and Beyond, Bath and Body Works. And we got some really cute stuff. I have, I have to show you my candle. And I, I went ahead, I did put it out. I told you I'm itching, but look. I found this, I found that little candle holder. And y'all, the candle that we bought for it is the um, balsam, fresh balsam. And we had it lit for 30 minutes and I was like, oh my gosh, it's like Christmas in here. I'm getting way too excited and I can't decorate. Um, but it smelled delicious and I love the little holder. So it's sitting on the table with my pumpkins and my cotton and you know, my fall decorations. But, um, oh, excuse me, no sun, no. Oh, what does he do when I'm not here? He's jealous, he knows it's Snuggle Tom, hence the name Snuggles. And uh, he, he knows when I start talking, he needs some attention. But, all right guys, I'm leaving you with that. We will show you um, some of the things that we got. Look for it, maybe tomorrow. Um, everybody just got, we, we came in, we got busy, we started cooking, finishing cooking, eating dinner, and getting ready for bed. So, boom, tomorrow's a new day, guys. Hope you all have a great day and a great night. We love you, and we'll see you tomorrow. JK, out.